and former inmates who went on to become productive citizens after incarcerated, after their incarceration ended, spoke to members of the community on how they succeeded in breaking free from the cycle of crime with a seminar called Treating the Illness, the Root of Causes of Crime and Ways to Heal. NBC6's Shirley Busico takes us there. It's people don't believe that they are, have worth, that they have value, that they're lying. Former inmates share their stories of how they were able to break the imprisonment cycle. We have formerly incarcerated um, returning citizens that have um, decided to step up on a community, you know, for a community effort to help um, individuals understand the root causes of incarceration, violence, crime, education, mental health. So they're just wanting to come back and reach out and help those youth in the community. One speaker spoke of violence and ways to deal with the underlying anger. Because when you're able to voice yourself and people are able to listen to you, then you can come up with a solution to your problem instead of acting out. I did 12 years, like I say again, in the federal system, but I made a choice to come home and turn my life around, right? I educated myself because being under Education is the key to everything. I would take today would be to actually go home and speak with my children about the you know the event today to um, let them know hey you know to there were people here that were you know incarcerated they changed their lives around um, and they are giving back to their community in a positive way. And we have to have something to look forward to. You know we got to start lead by example and uh, uh, being accountable for our actions. Shirley Busico, NBC Six News. The nonprofit Compassion for Lives also partnered with SPAR to sponsor the seminar.